There's hope this morning that the cause of Parkinson's disease may soon be treated instead of just the symptoms, thanks to a drug developed in Melbourne. Patrick Murrell is there for us this morning in Melbourne and such a wonderful uh, tradition of scientists and, and their breakthroughs in, your, in that city of Melbourne and it looks like we might be on the, the brink of another one, hopefully. Hopefully, Kieran, but it is still very early days. This announcement was made at the World Summit for Parkinson's in Canada overnight. The drug is purported to treat not just the symptoms of the disease, but also the underlying cause as well. It's been 15 years in the making, developed by scientists at the Florey Institute for Neurology, as well as the uh, Melbourne University. And what it does is it takes neurons that the uh, Parkinson's disease would see degenerate or die, and it turns them around, either healing them or slowing that progression of dying. This treats not just the symptoms, but also slows the spread of Parkinson's disease. The drug is taken in copper capsules twice a day. Now, this same drug has been used with success to treat motor neuron disease, slowing the progression of MND by 70%. With regards to Parkinson's, though, it's still very early days. This is all taken from a single trial of 19 patients with no control group. So results would have to be replicated in bigger and more complicated tests in the future, but still some very promising early results.